Thank you. I am uh, deeply humbled by the governor's confidence in me and by the opportunity to serve the state of Minnesota and on its highest court. One of the most important qualities of a judge, at least in my view, is humility. As I transition into my new role as an Associate Justice of the Minnesota Supreme Court, it is my hope to honor the tremendous work of the many justices and judges who have served in the Minnesota judiciary. I remain mindful that the role of a judge is a limited one, and the judges can't solve every problem. But at the same time, judges play a crucial role in safeguarding liberty and protecting the rights of all citizens. I will carry out my solemn responsibility as a justice the only way that I know how to do it. With as much energy and determination as I have shown in all my other endeavors throughout life, I will give my all to the people of Minnesota. I would be remiss if I didn't thank the many people who have deeply affected my life. I would like to first express my deep appreciation to my wife, Heather, who has been my rock and foundation for the nearly 13 years of our marriage. Thanks also to my two sons, Brandon and Benjamin, uh, who keep me busy on a daily basis. Uh, my sincere thanks also goes to my mother, who raised me for much of my childhood. Thanks also to my many mentors in the law, including Justice Thomas, Judge Ludig, uh, the late Judge Brunetti, as well as my many and precious colleagues at the University of Minnesota and the wonderful law firm of Fagri and Benson, where I've been privileged to practice law uh, for the past couple of years, for the past year. All the students I have taught over the past seven years have also deeply affected my life in a personal and positive way. Thank you. Each of you, everyone I've named, has challenged me to become a better lawyer, a better person, and now I hope an excellent and honorable judge as well. Last, but certainly not least, thank you so much, Governor Pawlenty, for your trust and for the opportunity that you have given me to serve the people of Minnesota.